So this was a suggestion uh, from Ghost Mail 66 about two weeks ago. He says, oh, I have something else for you to try if you haven't already. Go get a package of grasshopper cookies. We did. Pour yourself a glass of milk. Or Chris poured me a Cheers, bowl of mate. milk. Because what we're going to do next normal. might blow your mind. Then, take a teeny tiny bite out of the cookie. On the opposite side of the cookie, take another teeny tiny bite. There's no top flap. These aren't made by Nabisco, so oh. you can't easily get into them like an Oreo. Uh, now the fun part. Here's where things get really crazy. Use the cookie like a straw in the milk. Dunk it in. Suck the milk through the cookie. Finally, eat the whole cookie. So this is a uh, this is a grasshopper. There's no hole in it. Am I not getting the hole? <laughs> um. I don't know if this is a too too big of a hole. Does yours have a hole? Sorry if you hear wild children. Whoa, wait, wait, wait. Oh, shoot. He just poured milk on me. <laughs> it works. It does not work for me. Yeah, you have to go down to the milk. Mm. I figured it out, guys. Your head had... Yeah, I... <laughs> you know, that's neat. <clears throat> It is Sorry. like <laughs> I would never. It's like a little straw. What are you doing? Now, Grant, for the record, um, there aren't any holes. Oh my gosh! I just dropped the holes in the neck. This is not um a very inconvenient eating sport. <laughs> Something. There'll oh, be in the Olympics next year. I can see I it. I wouldn't do it. It's too messy. Look at this. I just. Put these jeans on like a couple hours ago. Now they have milk on them. And that's why it happened. If you wear old dirty clothes, you'll never spill. Mm -hmm. But you put on clean clothes, guarantee you. Baby will throw up on you. Or you spill milk while you're trying to drink out of a bowl with the grasshopper. I don't know if you guys saw what happened. We'll have to watch it later. She spilled. Oh, I got a cookie now in here. Sorry. I don't know if you can hear the animals in the dungeon, but um, <laughs> they're out of control. They're wild. <clears throat> they have energy. So if you're wondering what a grasshopper is, like if you're in a different country, it's not an insect. I just saved. It's it's a it's a mint and fudge uh, yeah. Keebler cookie. Uh, it's, hmm, napkins. Mm -hmm. I don't keep napkins in my mm -hmm. den. I do keep tissues though. Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh. Oh. <laughs> so like you can see there really isn't any uh any holes in there to so it what So it's kind of kind of interesting. Well, yeah. Are you having fun? Let me try again. <laughs> I'm doing it. This is so fun. We're flying, Peter. <laughs> Who came up with this? Like, what? Okay. Hi. We need to make these things bigger so you can just be like... Right. <laughs> Things to drink out of that are a little unorthodox. Red vines with soda. Yeah, that's that's a little more common than this yes. thing. The other thing that I love teaching uh, my kids and my sister's kids is drinking Jello through a straw. Normally, you do that also at a more restaurant. Common. You learned that from Better Off Dead. No, that was snorting. Like, snorting snow. That's and they snorted their Jello too. 
He did. That's right. Yeah. I don't think there was any snow starting in Better Off Dead. Uh, that's was when there? he said, "You know what the uh, street so value good. of this this mountain is? It's oh pure my. snow." <laughs> oh my gosh! If you do it too long, it starts to like crumble. Yeah, because the milk goes in there and just mm-hmm. like dissolves it. Best bet: stick it in your mouth. Like after you take your two bites, stick it in your mouth and then put your mouth to the to the cup and just. But when you eat it after you um, suck on the milk for a while, it's kind of creamy. Kids are out of control down there. If anybody needs three kids, what? And when I say needs, I, anybody wants three kids? They. <laughs> they're expensive. They so probably can't afford them. But if you want them, let us know. Wait, like I have to fit my face in this. Like, I got after you. a while, you can't do this anymore. <laughs> I got her. Well, I I got her a bowl because one, she's not a big milk drinker, but two, um, it's easier. I thought it would be easier to to uh, drink out of. Thanks. Looking out for her. There's a like glass glass, but it's like meep, all this milk. <laughs> teeny tiny right. Teeny tiny right. We're not really teeny tiny now. That's not even opposite side. So that means I gotta drink this way. You know what this reminds me of? The whistle my mom had when I was a kid. She would blow it when it was time to come in for dinner. (laughs) It's like so weird. It's like, it's kind of (laughs) loud. It just looks so weird doing it. And mm-hmm. then, and then it starts decomposing, and then you put it in your mouth, and it's like mm, a boy's cookie. I said the M word. She said the M word. Mm-hmm. Can't say moist; it's offensive. And that is good. That makes the cookie taste better. It's creamier because it's milky. And that's the way the cookie crumbles. In my mouth. So, Ghost Mail sixty six, who is in fact my friend Phil. Uh, thank you for the recommendation. If you have any recommendations that you would like us to try, try it. Let us know. It might um, be ridiculous, but I don't care if it's ridiculous or not because um, I'm not gonna lie. This is really unorthodox, but it's fun for for us. And that's all that matters. Mm. <laughs> so. <laughs> With that being said, give us a thumb up because we're not soggy and moist and you can take a bite out of... No, you can't. No. That would be like a fake news Friday or a Tuesday news day on some really creepy cannibalism. We already have enough of that as it is. I will say a tip. I would say like this and then keep your fingers out and rotate it so you go exactly on the other side, 180 degrees. You hear that? If you can hear that, I apologize. <laughs> you have to. And so then it's perfectly. Because I did make the mistake of making them like 140 degrees away. Not as good as 180 Mine degrees. Mine was this way. So well, how many degrees is that? 90. You don't want 90 degrees. No, I prefer. Facts <laughs> 90 <boys>. degrees. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> no. It's just weird. <laughs> Phil, thanks for this suggestion. It was super cool. I'm um, glad glad uh, mm. you told us about it. So, so give us a thumb up. Um, I give this a thumb up, actually. I think it's no. really uh, very creative. I love grasshopper cookies. <clears throat> Mint and fudge. And they're crunchy. Grasshoppers. Let's have real grasshoppers. Apparently, they're really good for you, and they make flour out of them. Protein. Mm-hmm. Well, so, I even saw that they made stuff out of um, cockroaches. So I mean, they have. Uh huh. It's weird. I don't know about that. I would. I don't want to get that disease. Subscribe if you haven't already. If you've made it this far. If you made it this far, right? What should we say? Grasshoppers in the comment? Grasshopper? Um, or if you made it this far, put... 
moist. Here we go. I just want to see the word you, moist on there and see if anybody says anything. So, there you have it. Thanks for watching. Subscribe, thumb up, share, because sharing is... Caring. Why well, do I always have to say caring? Well, the next time you say sharing is... We will share our cookie with you. It's so cute. So, yeah. I'm going to keep, I'm going to eat one more. Then I'm going to really stop. I'm just going to dunk mine in the chocolate and the, oh, yeah, or junk, the you, cookie in the milk. You could do that too. It's a different taste if you get it on the outside versus getting the milk on the inside though, I will say. And... I don't think I did this the other day. A lot of people have commented, if you have Oreos, you gotta have milk. So I'm gonna dunk my Oreo. Okay. Because apparently that's what you're supposed to do. Well, you just figured this out? No. I'm just slow. A little hack. Um, if... This video keeps going. If uh, okay. you eat Oreos and you don't want to like get your fingers in there... Stick a fork in your Oreo, and then you could dunk it in. It The fork holds the cookie. Why would it fall off the fork? What does a fork open it? Mm. Thank you for watching. Say goodbye, Leslie. Goodbye, Leslie. Well done. Goodbye, Chris. Bye. <laughs> Thanks for coming. Let we'll see you later. Moist grasshopper. Mm, moist grasshopper. <laughs> Separate. Moist grasshopper. Okay. Bye. Bye. <laughs>